Uh, Mayor Dayton? I haven't seen you around lately. How have you been? Everyone in town's been asking about you. I'm sure everyone will be so glad to see you. Oh, you know, I'm just... Whatever. I don't owe you a fucking explanation. Okay? Why did I yawn? What's the deal with that? <laughs> Anyways, hello friends. My name is Brandon Date and I'm your humble narrator. Welcome back to Animal Crossing New Leaf. That's what it is. I'm still rusty as hell. <laughs> Go ahead and catch a honeybee right out the bat. Ooh! Whose house is this? God, I'm so surrounded by neighbors. Gloria! Oh, that sounds glorious! <laughs> I gotta go check on my, um, my permit today. See how that's coming about. It has been a while since I played this. I've been stuck on Bundles and Pokemon Team Rocket Edition. God, I've been having such a good time. I'm sure the the neighbors are gonna be like, What the fuck, Dayton? You're such a monster. And I'll say, Yep! I'm busy, bruh. What do you want from me? Oh, nothing in there. Oh, there's, there's a notice. Fishing tourney? No. Tomorrow is nature day. I missed it. <laughs> Let's take some time to think about the planet we live on and celebrate the way it helps us each and every day of the year. That's true. That's true. But, uh, I guess I won't. Fishing tourney has concluded. God, I should really write some messages. Like, hey, bros. Hi, alligator lady. Are you mad at me? She's mad. Well, look who we have here. It's Dayton. Long time no see. Have you been? Yeah, hanging out. How are you? Watering plants? That's nice. What can I do for you, Dayton? Grr. What's up with it? How you been living? I've been having a hard time re redecorating my house, Dayton. I just need a certain something. But I'm just not sure what it is. Hey, could you possibly find something for me? Yeah, please find me something that will make my home decor great again, Dayton. Make my home decor great again. Count on me. I don't have anything in my pocket at the moment, so... Uh, I'll, I'll keep an eye out. How about that? Best I can do. Best I can do. Oh? Lost item? I picked up a lost item. I wonder if someone dropped this. Maybe I should look for the owner and return it. Yes. Yes, indeed. We shall do just that. I'm gonna dig the fuck out of these. Blech. There you go. Don't bother picking up dandelions. You're gonna crash the game. <laughs> oh, there's so many weeds and crap. I feel so bad I've just left my town. Oh! Ants! Ants! Got him! It's a big old ant. Mm-hmm. Oh my god, my, my two-year-old was taking a shower the other day. And he got fucking assaulted by ants. And now he's terrified to take a shower. So fucking sad. Boon! I missed you! <laughs> Look at his face. He's like, Holy shit! You're still alive! <laughs> yes, I am, Boon. <laughs> I came back for you. Whoa! Is that you, Dayton? It's been a while since I saw you. But you haven't changed at all. Oh, I missed you, buddy. I didn't mean to hit you with a shovel, though. <laughs> That's not good. Yo, Dayton! Am I having deja vu, Baboom? Didn't we just talk? Yeah, we did. Did you lose an item? Per perchance? I found this lost item by the pond over yonder. Here you go. Maybe? Not even close. I never owned anything like this. Can't be mine. Here's what you do, Dayton. Jog all over town looking for the rifle owner. Get those knees up. <laughs> Oh, Boone. That's why you have muscles. It's not because you're a, a a great baboon creature. It is because you enjoy exercise so very much. Oh, here we go with the fucking fossils again, right? Here we go, Dayton. Just just fossils all day, right? Oh, and gems. Also, gems. God, my town is just a mess. This is what happens. I go away for a week and just everything goes to shit. You guys can't have it be like this. I can't be the only one out here who's like, you know, trying to take care of things, alright? Because obviously I'm not that invested in taking care of things. <laughs> oh, fart. I'll try to clean it up. 
At least that's not like a uh, year's worth of collection or whatever. Let's go ahead and check in with Isabel, I suppose. Surely she won't judge me too harshly. I mean, she works hard. Obviously, I don't really. Uh, did you need something? Can, can you go stand on the counter or whatever? Okay, I need to go flex my mayoral muscle. Here we go. Come talk to me, receptionist, secretary, person. Oh, Mayor Dayton, you came at a great time. Your town development permit is here. You can finally get to work. As mayor, you have two primary ways to influence the growth of penis. <laughs> ah, it gets me every time. The first is ordinances. By enacting ordinances, you can change the way penises run. Of course, you can't just enact any old ordin ordinance you feel like enacting. That would make you a dictator. Aww. But I want to be a dictator. Because my dick looks like a tater. <laughs> God damn it. Instead, you're able to choose an ordinance out of a list provided to you. Try to choose ordinances that match up with the lifestyles and needs of penises residents. The second way to exercise your mayoral power is by starting public works projects. Public works projects add buildings and features to penis. I've already taken the liberty of putting together a list of requests from the town citizens. If there's a request that really speaks to you, please select it to begin development. That's all I have for you right now, but when you decide to start on either of those, I'll explain further. When you'd like to work on official mayoral business, just sit in that chair and I'll help you out. I was... I was just sitting in this chair. You not see me sitting in the fucking chair? I'm sorry, Isabel. I, I didn't mean to be cross with you. Especially after being absent for so long. That's, that's not nice of me. Is there something I can help you with? Yes! Let's check out those ordinances, please and thank you. Okay! Uh, at present, there are no ordinances in effect. To enact an ordinance, a processing fee of 20,000 bells is required. Once enacted, ordinances can be cancelled for free. Shall we continue? Um... Okay. Are you gonna pay me now? What kind of town would you like Penis to become? Uh... A wealthy town. I mean, man, I don't know. Night Owl Town sounds good, too. I have played more times late at night than I have during the day, but... That's not been even really that consistent. What's a wealthy town all about? Great idea, I can see it now! A town where the economy's rock solid and you can sell items for more bells than you can imagine. That's your grand vision for Venus, right? Uh, sorta? Okay, so you want to sign the Bell Boom Ordinance into law? Um, what does it mean? <laughs> I don't exactly know what I'm signing here. I can't do it. Gotcha. Signing legislation is a big deal, so you could, so you should think it over carefully. Is there anything else I can help you with? How about them works projects? Oh, public works projects are exciting. Allow me to explain explain the fascinating process. <laughs> I'm sure it's super exciting. Choose a project from the list that citizens have made. Once you've chosen a project, we'll go search for a place to build it. Once we've found a spot for it, we'll need to raise the construction funds by asking for donations. Then, after we conduct enough donations to fully fund the project, the structure will be built. Please keep in mind that we only have the resources to work on one public works project at a time. Well then, let's dive right in. Here are the current requests. Hmm. Swap. Reset center, cobblestone bridge, suspension bridge. Park clock, campsites. We need a bridge, don't we? Let's make a bridge. 128,000 bells? Good god. Reset center? I don't know what this is. Yellow bench, 30,000 bells. Why is it all so pricey, man? You know that you know the citizens ain't gonna help with any of this crap. They're gonna be like, eh, whatever. <laughs> Face cutout sign, standy, do not enter sign. We gotta do a bridge. We have to. It's gonna cost so much, but I just I just feel like we need a second bridge. Would you like to start work on the cobblestone bridge? Let's do it. Alright. Yay, let's go find a place to build. Hi, Dan. Okay, Mayor Dayton, please lead me to the spot where you'd like to place the cobblestone bridge. Mmm... Like over here, I think. Not too far. I don't, I don't know. Like maybe this would be a good spot to put it, but then they're both facing south, so I might get kind of confused. 
Uh, it's it's gonna be somewhere on this bend. Can we do it on the bend? Uh, how about here? Yes, Mayor. Would you like to set the cobblestone bridge somewhere around here then? Yeah, what do you think? Well, let's see. Yeah, I think this would be perfect. It'll probably look something like this when it's all finished. Whoop, 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 whoop. What do you think? Is this the spot? Yeah. Do it. Understood. Well, let's go ahead and start the needed preparations. 128,000 bells. All set. To help us gather donations to fund the cobblestone bridge is our helpful town joyride. Gyroid. Lloyd. Hi, Lloyd. He's basically like a donations box. I'm sure I mentioned it to you before, but all of the construction costs for the public works projects in Penis are covered entirely by donations. Gosh. We need a better form of government. <laughs> of course, you can chip in some of your own money too, Mayor. Actually, I get the feeling we won't be able to gather enough funds if you don't help us out. Please don't forget to donate. It'll be hard to wait for all the donations we'll need to complete the cobblestone bridge here. By the way, including this new one, we have we can have a total of three bridges in town at any one time. Ah, good to note. I thought it was just two. As such, if you want to build a new bridge after that, you'll have to demolish an existing bridge first. Well then, I'm going to make my way back to the town hall. Ah, there's no need for you to go back with me, Mayor. I'll just be taking my leave now. Okay, bye. What's up with it, Lloyd? How you living? Good afternoon. Hey, contribute to a campaign to fund a cobblestone bridge. Our target fund is 128,000 bells. We have collected zero bells. Even one bell will help. We ask for your cooperation. I will cooperate. Um, jeez. I guess like one, 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 zero. And I helped. Thanks for your cooperation. It could go faster than I think if we just really grind it out, you know what I mean? But there's so much other stuff to buy. How can you just be like, oh, well, this is, this is what I want first. I'm not going to pay back Tom Nook at any point. I'm just going to buy a bridge for the town. That's irresponsible. That's fiscal irresponsibility. And I don't approve. Chili fish. Maybe I'll put it in a chili dish. <laughs> that, that got me more than it should. That's dumb as hell, but it got me. I have to admit it. Hmm. I guess I'll go fill up my pockets. Go get some shells or something. Holy shit. Bro, are you okay? Meh. Meh. Are you... Do you need... What did I have to do with this guy? Give him fish? I think I gotta give him a fish. My pockets are full already. Already is right. It's too bad you can't expand your inventory or something. Hmm. Hmm. Lizzie. But you are my lobster. What? <laughs> Huh? Lizzie! Well, you were my lobster! Okay, bro, just enjoy your beach nap, I guess. I don't know what's, what's going on there. Oh, I gotta go sell some stuff. Oh, there's more ants out here. I forgot I dropped candy all around the town. What a generous person I am. I'm the real Easter Bunny! That's right! <laughs> ding dong, ding dong! I have a gift for you! Oh, hello, welcome! Quite, quite. Can I sell to you, please? Oh, you want to sell something? What'd you bring? Let's see. I got... Oh, gold nugget. I kind of want to keep it. How about a honeybee? How about a killifish? I know I don't need the white butterflies or the seashells. Do I need ants? I don't know. There's a lot of stuff I want to donate to the museum. I think the killifish needs to go to the museum, too. Maybe the pill bug? I guess we'll see. Is this everything? I'll start crunching the numbers. Uh, I could probably part with 640 bells. Yeah, whatever. A paltry sum for all the work that I've done. Shameful. But, you know, I guess everybody's got to try and make a profit, something like that. So, whatever, dude. I'm just gonna go catch some more fish. I'm gonna get rich without your help. 
A tadpole. I'm sure it'll grow on me. Much like Nico has, right? Am I right, friends? Ooh, pitfall seed. Tell you what. Not gonna get me. Not today. Oh boy. More. More money. No! Fuck! You ruined everything! Oh crap. Well, one and two and three is six, and then four is eleven, so one thousand one hundred bells. That's sad. I kind of just screwed myself there. But I didn't expect that to be the rock that had the bells in it today. I guess you just really, really can never tell. So sad when that happens. Hey, fish! Mm. I need money! I need money, fish! Are you a goldfish? Are you a goldfish or a silverfish? Come along. God, this just never works. There we go. Ooh, buddy! Ooh, that's a long one. A loach! It wasn't hard to approach. That's what she said. That's a long one, or it wasn't hard to approach. Why not both? Hey, did you lose an item, Allie? Aren't you busy, Dayton? Is there something you wanted? Um, did you drop this? Maybe? I found a, 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 an item that maybe is yours, perhaps? Possibly? I can't say I've seen that before, Dayton. Must belong to someone, though, Gra. Okay, I'll keep looking. I wish I knew what kind of item it was. That might give me a clue. Is it is it a girl item or a boy item? Well, here's all my boys. <laughs> Nico said that Vic's uh, Vic's song sounds like the the brown note from South Park, and he's totally right. I think I just shit my pants. Oh, Dayton, you're you're still alive. <laughs> Despite all attempts, yeah. Where you been? You disappeared without saying anything to anyone, so I've been pretty worried, you know? I heard some other people say they seen you just like normal. Made me cry, you big greenie. Well, you're not my favorite, I'll be honest with you. But you're pretty alright. What's going on, cud? Did you drop something? Maybe, perhaps? I bet it was Paula. She likes me, she left it so I would come to her house. Mm-hmm. She ain't never, she ain't never gonna move. This isn't mine, I think you should ask somebody else. Okay. Then, uh, let's continue on. I'm sure there's plenty of people around. It's gonna belong to the last person that I talk to, which is good, because then I'll be forced to, like, check in with everybody. You know what I mean? Who lives here? Uh, Boone. Yeah, that's my boy. You don't even know where your boy lives? Yeah, so what? Yeah, so what? Wanna fight about it? My name's Patty Tanager, the candy manager. <coughs> so what? Wanna fight about it? Oh, Graham, that's why you wear glasses, because you're always on the computers. It's got servers and all types of shit. Hmm. I thought he was just a self important jackass, but it turns out he's a self important nerdy jackass. <laughs> Look like you've grown stronger since I last saw you. Yeah, okay. Whatever. I feel like we need more dancing happening right now. Shoom! Okay, that's a little better. Shut up! Did you drop this or what? <laughs> hey, stupid! You, you dropped this or something? Huh? I shouldn't be so mean to the rodents. Yeah, this is it! It's the paper bag I was looking for! In this bag, there's a... Uh, no, never mind. This bag is completely empty. Anyway, thank you so much. What the fuck? <laughs> I can't let you leave before I give you something good in return. I'm not sure if you'd like it, but here, I'll give you a present. Take my extinguisher with you. Indeed, just a little something as a thank you. Oh, fire extinguisher, great. Fire safety is so important to me. Uh huh. I didn't actually lose something that important, so... I didn't accidentally lose something really important, so I owe you, Dayton. The paper bag's important? You're weird. No, don't sit on that. Don't sit on this gross cushion. 
You might catch whatever it is he has. The one thing I will say in Graham's favor is he told me that he wanted to create something that people would remember. And I totally identify with that, at least. So, you know, I, I gotta cut him a little break, I guess. Bet. More honeybees! They're not as worth as much as I thought. Should I swap it? Yeah, I guess. We could leave something out here. Uh, let's just put the gold nugget down for now. And I'll totally just add these bells to my balance. Boop, 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 boop. I didn't actually check to see if my math was correct, but you know what? Whatever. Whatever, son. Now I can hold this. Ha ha. I suppose uh, we should do a trip to the museum and shit like that. But... Maybe not. I mean, if, if if pocket space was not so important, then it wouldn't be, like, an issue. I'd just be like, whatever, I'm carrying around a shit ton of fossils. Pale chub, it could use some sun. Yeah, bro, that's exactly, uh, that's my, f my fucking spirit fish. <laughs> Pale chub, what up with it? Um, let's, 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 let's cast. The perfect cast. Oh my god. The thing bit immediately. That was that was so mean. I had no chance. And I fucking psyched myself out on the other one! <laughs> I'm so upset now. Come here, fucking butterfly. Yeah, you'll make me feel better. You're so fucking beautiful. <laughs> oh boy. Shum! Shum! Um, no, turn, and then show him. He's flying right through my fucking head. Are you taunting me? <laughs> Talking to Graham put me in a bad mood, like, legit. Oh, God. There's also, like, a little squirrel that I don't really like. But, yeah, few are as bad as Graham. I do identify with him a little bit in some ways. Obviously, I'm sort of a computer nerd myself. Oh, shit. What do I swap? What do I swap? Pitfall seed. Duh. Bury it in the Connor. There you go. I'll probably forget about that at some point. Fucking many episodes from now. I never come over here. I think that'll be funny. I hope the second it happens, I fucking flash back and I'm like, Ah! Oh, do you remember the seed? I remember the seed. <laughs> All right, we out here now. Um, I guess I could pay off some of my debt. Probably what I should do is like, donate whatever I can to the museum, sell the rest of Nickling Junction, but of course, first things first, check out the Able Sisters. That's what I do. I miss them so much. Hello. See, they always got some sort of crazy crap in here for me to buy. The beak. That's not a bad choice. 640 bells. Can I have it? Oh, uh, it seems your pockets are full. Bitch. <laughs> oh, the one-up cap is so cool. And I also like this green ranger. Oh, it's red. I'm so fucking colorblind. I hate it. Ah. <sighs> well, let's see if they have, like, a matching shirt or something at least. I really do like the duck bill and the one-up hat and the, the green ranger helmet. It's a fucking Red Ranger helmet. What What is going on? Welcome! Hey! Callie, what are you doing? Oh, it seems like I haven't seen you in a really long time. Glad you decided to leave your house and get outside for a bit. You said that to me last time I left my house. I'm gonna stop leaving my house if you keep saying that. <laughs> How can I help, we? I just want to say what's up. How are you? I do want a pocket guide to fashion, but I always have too much in my pockets to carry it. Fucking preach. They have a policeman's thing up there, too. Um, I do appreciate your coming in so often, but I just got a ton of work to do. I'm very sorry. That's cool. At least you talked to me today. Thanks. You come back now. Y'all come back now. You hear? Alright, so fast forward. Uh, I hit the museum. I got one thing that actually uh, I was able to keep, so that's pretty sweet. Let's see this wallpaper. Oh, it's just wrapping paper. 
Dick hole. Do not want. I think I gotta spend some money here. Hmm. Or is it selling things? Is it just transactions of some sort? I don't really know. But, uh, we did get a raptor skull, so I'm hoping that I can get a good amount of money for that. I think I'm gonna give this uh, extinguisher to Allie. She made a special request of me. Who am I to refuse? Hmm, that would mean... Yeah, I can buy these for 5,900 bells. Cool. I think that's mostly from, like, the gold nugget that I found. Gold nugget and raptor skull. Hell yeah. This table is fucking hideous. A large alpine table? Yeah! <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> I don't think so, bro. Not... Not in this life. <laughs> fucking A. Back to the Able Sisters. Hooray! Oh, oh, welcome. Welcome back. Yeah, thanks. I just thought maybe I could try out this blue star shirt. It might go with my helmet. Big star tee? I'm a real fan. Cost 400 bells. Yeah, right? Let me have that. I mean, I got, I got so much... So much extra money today after selling my, uh, raptor skull and whatever. Ooh, looks pretty snazzy. I do like the big arrow pointing at my junk, but I, I have an arrow pointing at my junk on my head too, so I guess it's kind of okay, right? <laughs> oh. I talked myself out of the duck bill, largely because, like, this, who makes a fucking duck face? What is it, 2003 again? Blue cap? What's on the back of it? What's the logo? Can I try it on? Still can't see the logo. Oh, my hair's sticking out. I look like a douchebag. I don't want it. Da da da! It's the fucking coolest sound ever. The one up cap? Not a bad choice. 320 bells. Does it look any better than the backwards cap? Kinda. That sporty look is great on you. Thank you. Thank you for your kind lies. I'll take it. <laughs> Thanks! I've received 320 bells! Should I buy glasses? I don't wear glasses. I'm, I'm gonna wear the beak. Yeah, I talked myself out of it, but then I saw it again, and I'm like, maybe I do want it. <laughs> maybe I do need it after all. I don't know. I'm just weak, okay? Look how dumb I look. <laughs> wow, everybody, look how dumb I look! That's fun. Thanks, guys! I'm gonna be a, a furry, but like a duck. Is that like a feathery? <laughs> it's not even a good joke. Alright, enough clowning around. Let's head back to town. I kind of want to save up money for an ordinance. But I'll have to see what the ordinances do before making a decision. I think some of them could be pretty cool, but like... Yeah, how many extra bells am I actually getting? Is it worth paying fucking 20,000 bells? Hey, dude, what's up? Where you been? Don't you know I was worried about you, Dayton? Aw, sorry, Clay. Hey, I got a question for you. You're not a hamster, right? <laughs> you haven't been on vacation? You've just been avoiding me. Well, to make up for it, from now on, you have to talk to me every day. It's gonna be great, I swear. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know about all that. Hi again, what's happening, Thump? I'm just bored, dude. What's up with you? Are you any good at cleaning the houses, Dayton? I'm terrible at it, but if someone's coming over for a visit, then I can make myself do it. Wait, that's it! You should come over to my place! I'll make sure everything's clean before you get there. Uh, can't today. We're almost out of time. Okay, well, maybe next time, Thump. Not to be like a dick, but, you know, if if I don't make it on time, then he's gonna be fucking butthurt about it, which... I just can't deal with that right now. People are already butthurt enough that I, uh... <laughs> that I don't show up to my town for a week at a time. They're like, oh my god, Dayton, dick move! And I'm like, bro, I... I don't know, I'm playing other video games, what do you want? I'll tell you what I want. I won't go say hi to Paula. This is Paula, this is Cherry. Should I say hi to Cherry? Oh, she she ain't she ain't in there. Oh fuck, I scared the praying mantis. 
I think I think those are valuable. I think I could sell that for a lot of money. Get this shit out of here. Boom. Sweet. I also want to evict some residences. Like I picked this this spot for my house, and everybody's fucking just crowding the shit out of me, dude. Oh, there's Paula. Paula. Paula, what up? How you living, Paula? It's been a minute, Paula. Oh, look, she's so happy. Oh, long time no see, Dayton. What's it been? Three weeks? I guess that's not too long. Has it really been three weeks? God damn, I feel like shit. <laughs> yeah, I showed up for her birthday and, and just ghosted her. But you've got a big presence here, so even a few days feels like a long time without you. But anyway, glad you're all right, Yodelay. She's so cool about it. Everybody else is like, what the fuck, Dayton? And she's like, yeah, three weeks, that's not that bad. <laughs> You're looking at me weird, Yodelay. I just missed you. Can I be honest? You're so cool. Hey, you going over to see Graham anytime soon? If you are, there's something I want to... I want you to give back to him, okay? Yeah, all right. For you, not for him. You're the best. Okay, here you go. Sweet. Thanks, bro. It's not too much of a hurry on this. Sometime today will be fine. Alright. I should just go <laughs> go to my house with it and be like, yeah. Yeah, Graham's a dick. He's never getting this back. Whatever. Was that a, a weed or not? I'm not really sure. I don't even care. Just destroy it. Am I going to see Graham? Well, no, I wasn't. Until now. Hey, Poop Mouth. What's up? Hmm, you come back for another visit, Dayton? Can't believe it. I really hoped you'd like my place, indeed. I mean, the computers are cool. You got, like, gaming stuff, or you want Steam, or what? What's up with it? <laughs> nah, just kidding. I ain't never gonna be a Steam friend. But I do got a delivery for you. Paula asked me, and I like her. So I give this to you, even though I don't like you. <laughs> Maybe we're just too similar. That's what it is. Oh, is that the thing I lent to Paula a while ago? I didn't expect I'd ever see this item again. Just assume Paula was gonna keep it for herself. Don't you fucking talk about Paula! <laughs> Let's have some fun. What do you think's in here? If you can guess correctly, I'll give you a present. Um... Food would not come back. Maybe clothing. You guys are different sizes, though. Uh, maybe it's furniture. I'm just gonna go with the generic furniture. Okay, furniture, right? That's what you think it'll be? Well, let's open it up. It's clothing! Damn. I had logic. You're a better delivery boy than a guessing champ. Fuck. You. Even if you're an awful guesser, I still appreciate you coming all this way for a delivery, Dayton. Yeah, thanks for nothing, you fuck. <laughs> well, what else do I really have to do today? I guess I could go report back to Paula and be like, Hey, I did the fucking thing. I could also try and find Allie and give her the uh, fire extinguisher. I think that would be a, a wise thing. Hey, what up? Well, hello again. Making the most of today, Dayton. Was there something you wanted? I brought it. Here, I, br I brought you a thing. And you can have it. My gift to you. Oh, Dayton, you chose an extinguisher for me? This seems very fitting for my home. You've got good taste. Just can't wait to see how this looks in my home. Oh, that's right. I owe you a nice thank you gift, don't I? Hmm. What is that? Why don't you take this? It's an oil barrel. Um. I guess, I guess she's fireproofing her home, you know? She's like, you gave me a fire extinguisher. Also take this oil barrel. <laughs> That is constantly burning. But yeah. I guess that'll about do it for today, friends. I, oh, maybe I, maybe I do want to talk to Paula. Maybe, is there, is she going to give me something? Fucking destroyed a flower. Damn it! Sun's pretty high now. Even if I'm not sleepy anymore, you delay. So what's up? I delivered it. Oh, really? Thank you. So, did Graham say anything? Yeah? Totally. Really? I never know what that guy's thinking. Feels good to give it back, though, Yodelay. 
Okay, nothing from her either. Well, just fuck me today, I guess. <laughs> Oh, anyways, friends, I hope that you've enjoyed this episode. I hope that you will like, comment, and or subscribe if you did. I hope you check out the links in the description to Twitter, Discord, Patreon. Big shout out to Nico the Legend and Damon Darkstar for supporting us on Patreon currently. I hope that you will join us for the next one, friends. Always a pleasure. Thank you so much for running around out here with me today. <laughs> and I shall see you in the next one. So until then, friends... What is the fish? Just get the fish in there. Oh, cool. It's a barbell steed. Bye-bye. <laughs>